This is a PSAW Creator tutorial for adding a library dependency. In a previous tutorial, we created a library project to contain various components. Here, we will add that library as a dependency so the components will be available to use in a design project. In the Workspace Explorer, right-click on the project and select Dependencies. On the dialog, Notice that the project already has system dependencies for Cypress provided components. To include other libraries, under User Dependencies, click the New Entry button. Navigate to the library project location, select it, and click Open. The library is added under User Dependencies. For each library you add, there are two checkboxes. Components means to include the component files, such as the symbol, schematic, and APIs. Code means to include source code from the library project, which is not specific to any component. In most cases, you will only select Components here. When finished adding dependencies, click OK. Depending on how the components have been defined in the project, you may see one or more new tabs in the component catalog. Adding a user library only adds the dependency for the selected project. If you want to add a dependency for all projects, you must add a default dependency. To do this, start with no projects or workspaces open. Click on the Tools menu and select Options. On the dialog, expand the Project Management category and select Default Dependencies. As with the Dependency dialog, click the New Entry button. Then, navigate to the Library Project location, select it, and click Open. Then, click OK to close the Options dialog. Create a new project, and notice that the Component Catalog contains one or more new tabs. Open the Dependency dialog again. Notice that the dependency is already included under the User Dependency section. This dependency will be available for all new and existing projects going forward. For more information about creating components, refer to the PSAW Creator Component Author Guide.